Hello there, my name is Richard McMunn from the interview training website, passmyinterview.com, and in this tutorial, I will teach you how to pass a data engineer interview. So if you are applying to become a data engineer with any company or organization, make sure you stay tuned because I promise to help you be the standout candidate. And to achieve that goal, this is what I will cover during this tutorial. Number one, I will give you a list of data engineer interview questions that I strongly recommend you prepare for. These questions come up all the time during data engineering interviews, and it's really important to prepare answers to them. Number two, I will then give you several tips for answering each of the questions before, number three, giving you brilliant example, top scoring answers to all of the data engineering interview questions that will help you be the standout candidate. And then finally, I will tell you where you can download further resources and the answers to help you pass your data engineer interview. And just very quickly, if you are new to the channel, please do make sure you hit that subscribe button. By subscribing, you will be the first person to be alerted as soon as I upload fresh content. And more importantly, by subscribing, I can then help you to not just progress throughout your career, I can also help you to negotiate a salary. And please give the video a like, because that tells me you find these tutorials useful and it also motivates me to create more content for you. Thank you very much for your support. So let's now start working through some data engineer interview questions, tips and example answers. So right at the very start of your data engineer interview, the hiring manager will say to you, tell me about yourself, or they might say, introduce yourself. Whichever question they start with, I recommend giving the same answer. Let me give you two tips before I give you a brilliant example response. Tip number one. So this is going to be the first data engineer interview question that you must answer. And it is essential that you build a positive connection with the interviewer. And you can do that by practicing your answer. Because if you give a confident response right at the very start of your interview, it sets you up for the rest of the job interview. But it also tells the hiring manager that you have prepared fully for your interview. And that's important. And tip number two, in your response, describe yourself using positive keywords and phrases that match the job description. So it's important to read the job description before you attend your data engineer interview. Let me now give you a brilliant example answer to help you pass your interview. Tell me about yourself, here we go. Thank you for giving me the opportunity to be interviewed for this data engineering position with your company today. I would describe myself as an industrious, astute, and technically focused data engineer who has the capacity to take on a large workload and deliver everything that is expected of me to a high standard and on time. I have a track record of achievement. So for example, in my last role, the organization had never employed a data engineer before. I helped them build a new algorithm that enabled the data scientists and business analysts to quickly access the company's large database to identify trends and customer behavior opportunities, which in turn increased customer satisfaction rates, revenue and profits. Now, in my work as a data engineer, I always focus on improving the reliability and usability of company data. Whilst I would describe myself as a highly technical data engineer, I also have excellent interpersonal and soft skills that mean I can communicate my findings and recommendations in an easy to understand manner. And because I am commercially driven, everything I do will be geared towards helping you maintain your position as a market leader. Now, if you hire me as a data engineer, I will make sure you see a strong return on your investment and I will always take ownership of my ongoing professional development so the work I do for you is hugely beneficial to the company and its strategic objectives. That is a brilliant in-depth answer that will set you up with confidence for the rest of your data engineer interview. Now you can either pause the video if you want to and take down the interview questions and answers as we work through them together. Or if you want to wait, I will soon tell you where you can instantly download my full set of 26 data engineer interview questions 
and top scoring example answers, including the ones we are covering together today. Here's the next question for you. Why do you want to be a data engineer? Tip number one, before you attend your data engineer interview, my advice is to write down a list of the things you find appealing about the work, because this will help you to construct a passionate answer that demonstrates your enthusiasm for the role. And tip number two, in your answer, talk about how you enjoy making a difference to a team or organization and that you enjoy making others' lives easier through your work as a data engineer. So here's my example answer to help you. Why do you want to be a data engineer? Here we go. I want to be a data engineer because the work is varied. It requires intense technical skills, which I enjoy. And there is always something new and challenging to work on. I am passionate about building and creating things that make others' lives easier. Now, although I am a competent collaborator and team worker, I also enjoy working on individual projects, and I like nothing more than being given a specific technical task, which is then down to me to achieve within strict timescales. Now, being a data engineer requires the skill of identifying new trends and technological advancements. Because I am a strong networker and I take my professional development seriously, I am usually the first to identify new and exciting ways of working, which are highly useful to the organization I am working for. Finally, I find the earning potential of being a data engineer appealing. I have goals outside of work that I want to achieve, and the only way I will achieve those is if I work hard and my employer sees a strong return on their investment through the work I carry out for them. So that's another detailed answer that helps you be the standout candidate. Now, don't go anywhere because I still have more questions and answers to give you, but when you're ready, you can click that link in the top right-hand corner of the video Head straight through to my website, passmyinterview.com, and you can instantly download my full set of 26 data engineer interview questions and top scoring example answers, including the ones we are working through together today. Here's the next question I recommend you prepare for. So why do you want to work for us? Tip number one, this question will come up during your interview. And in your answer, Talk about how you will get to make a positive difference to their company because of the opportunities you can see for them based on data engineering. And tip number two, I also recommend talking about how you have researched their organization and you have heard nothing but positive things about their values and how they operate. So let me now give you a top scoring example answer to help you pass your interview. Why do you want to work for us? Here we go. I want to work for you because I see lots of opportunities in your industry for me to make a difference to your company. Over the years, I have built up extensive experience in various fields and organizations that will be of benefit to your organization. I also want to work for you because during my research and the people I spoke to, it quickly became apparent that you are innovative, you are forward thinking, and you have a great set of company values. Now, working for you will give me the creative freedom I need to find solutions for your business that will help you drive forward and maintain your position in this industry. That's another strong and positive answer that will help you pass. Here's the next question. Explain to me in simple terms what data engineering is and why it is so important. So this next data engineer interview question assesses your ability to explain things to non-technical people in simple terms, something that is essential to your work. Tip number two, in your answer, demonstrate an awareness of how your work as a data engineer must help their organization take advantage of opportunities that are present within their sector or industry. So here's my example answer to help you. Explain to me in simple terms what data engineering is and why it is so important. In very simple terms, data engineering is the process of designing and building things to create workable solutions for an organization that provide actionable insights. Now, data engineering is essentially building pipelines that transform and deliver data in a usable state for data scientists and business analysts to then use. Data engineering is so important because it helps a company find solutions to data analytics challenges that present the greatest opportunities for commercial development and growth. So that's an example answer. Obviously, based on your own experience, you can add to that as you wish. But it's another great answer 
that demonstrates your confidence in your work. Here's another tricky question. What makes a good data engineer? Tip number one, the most effective way to answer this common data engineering question is to read the job description before you attend your interview. Tip number two, in your answer, be sure to reference the importance of being able to collaborate with managers and departments to create workable solutions, systems and processes that help the business achieve its commercial and strategic goals. So here's my example answer. What makes a good data engineer? Here we go. A good data engineer has outstanding problem solving capabilities. They can listen to a brief and then find workable solutions that help the business meet its commercial and financial objectives. A good data engineer will be able to collaborate with and listen to line managers and the senior management team to quickly gain a grasp of what the company wants to achieve. They will then work tirelessly to create workable systems and processes that achieve those goals. Now, finally, a good data engineer possesses exceptional technical skills in diverse fields and they have specialist knowledge in areas such as software engineering and program languages. That's another really good solid answer. Now, this is a really difficult question. What are your strengths and weaknesses? Tip number one, this again will come up during your data engineer job interview. My advice is to give several strengths that are a match for the job description. So make sure you read the job description before your interview. Tip number two, for the weakness part, be very careful which one you give. My advice is to give a genuine weakness, but one that will do you no harm in your interview. Here's my example answer to help you. What are your strengths and weaknesses? My strengths include my fast pace of working, my deep dive analytical skills, and the fact I can create and build pipelines that solve organizational challenges and help a company to grow. I also possess diverse skills, such as being able to quickly interpret data and trends to establish the root of a problem and find a solution. Now, although I am primarily a data engineer, I can operate as an analyst too, which means you can use me on a variety of different projects. Other strengths include the fact I am a brilliant collaborator and team worker. I can explain complex terminology in simple terms to people who might otherwise not understand. And I'm also commercially driven. Now being commercially driven means that I fully understand the work I do is linked to your financial and commercial success. Now my weakness is the fact I can be slightly stubborn at times when it comes to problem solving. I tend to try and figure things out on my own as opposed to asking other people in my team for assistance, which could be a faster way of working. Now, having said that, another strength of mine is my passion for self-development. If you see something in my work you want me to develop or change, simply tell me and I will go away and make the necessary improvements. That's a really clever answer because you are starting out and giving lots of strengths. You are then giving a good weakness. That's a really good weakness to give, but you are then finishing off with another strength because you are aware of your weaknesses and you are not afraid to take on board constructive feedback and ultimately improve. So it's a great example answer. Now, the next thing to do is please make sure you click that link right now in the top right hand corner of the video, head straight through to my website, passmyinterview.com, and you can instantly download my full set of 26 data engineer interview questions and top scoring answers, including the ones we have worked through together today. It's a fantastic resource and it's going to put you ahead of the competition. Now, make sure you go through to that page because on there I have also included some more tips that will help you pass your data engineer interview. And I've also given you some example questions to ask at the end of your interview. Finally, don't forget to subscribe. It's really important because then I can help you progress throughout your career and also negotiate a salary. Please give the video a like. It's a small ask, but it genuinely motivates me to create more content for you. Thank you so much. And also, don't forget to connect with me on LinkedIn. I've put my LinkedIn link in the description below the video, and it is always a pleasure and an honor to connect with like-minded professionals such as yourself. Thank you so much for watching, and I wish you all the best for passing your job interview. Have a great day.